Here's how I use a deepfake AI to turn myself into Harrison Ford. The most recent Indiana Jones film just probably had some of the best deepfake visual effects I have ever seen. Now, I'm usually one to hate on deepfake visual effects. Yeah, but this one was just absolutely Mwah, incredible. For ages, deepfake technology has been incredibly complicated and expensive. With new rises in AI and hearing that Disney and ILM actually use deepfake stable diffusion AI to actually de-age Ford, it got me wondering. I wonder if I could create my own deepfake Harrison Ford using only AI. So I searched across dozens of deepfake face swap websites and eventually I came across this website, Acool. Acool is absolutely incredible. Like there's literally no sponsor. They're just, they're just insane. It works by using deep learning algorithms to analyze facial expressions and landmarks, which helps it create seamless facial swaps. And no, it's not free. It's literally only $30, you cheapskates. Just like go mow a lawn or something. It was the best 30 bucks I ever spent. No cap. So I filmed a test version of myself and literally grabbed one screenshot of Harrison Ford and that is insane, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is this is crazy. My mind was absolutely blown. It, it's incredible. Not only was it able to keep a stable image of Harrison Ford's face over mine, but it also maintained stable lighting and the correct skin tone. And because I'm a sucker for recreating stuff, I decided to recreate the first opening scene of Indiana Jones Dial of Destiny. I grabbed my brother. We built a mini Indiana Jones site literally in our garage. I made sure that we had stable lighting throughout the entire shots, and I shot all shots on the tripod just so it make it cool easier to keep the track on my face. Literally right after we finished filming though, I thought back to the opening scene and I wish we had like a fedora or whip to show just to show it's an Indiana Jones film. And then I thought, we also have Photoshop generative fill AI. So I hopped on Photoshop, grabbed the screenshot of the opening clip and extended the image. And I'm dead serious, I just typed add a brown fedora hat on top of a box. And dude, this is absolutely insane. I created a 3D title scene in Element 3D and After Effects, which if you wanna learn how to create, you can check out this tutorial right here. I exported it and voila, Ah, me as young Harrison Ford. Shout out A Cool. Spot. Are you alone? I like to be alone. If you want to check out the final video result clip, you can check it out here at our Instagram. Make sure to follow us there. And if you liked or found any value from this video, please be sure to smash the like button and hit subscribe. It's free. All this content is free, so it really means a lot. Stay creative, guys, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.